An amateur artist expected to be the highlight of a charity art exhibit this week. While his work is expected to fetch a couple hundred dollars, Wave 3 News reporter Scott Atkins discovered buyers may be more impressed with his artistic temperament. A six-year-old. He took on pretty fast. Who just picked up a brush last year will be featured in an auction gallery alongside nationally renowned artists. I would say it should go for several hundred dollars at the event. And like all abstract art. Do you see a horse here? You may interpret the acrylic painting differently than she does. A bird landing on a plant. It's just a fabulous abstract with a great color palette. Not that Ann Schultz is a parent trying to make a profit. I have no interest in selling it myself. I wanted it to, to be a benefit. Eco paint? Very nice. Because the real Picasso behind the canvas is Polo. After he understood to not chew the paintbrush, then it pretty much went fine, but it was pretty much take and chew. <laughs> Schultz knew if Polo learned key commands. Take, hold, carry, and touch. He could pick up her talent. It just made sense since I train and I paint that my, that my dog would paint. So <laughs> it just seems like it made sense that the two of them went together. Polo, you get the brush? Poodles are retrievers. All it takes is time, patience, and a treat. Oh, good boy. Since Anne doesn't sell Polo's paintings, it made sense to donate one to benefit other canines and cats. It is a great conversation piece because it's a painting by a pet at an event to raise money for pets. A six-year-old whose work is expected to fetch hundreds of dollars. It amazes me that there's a swan. Scott Atkins, Way 3 News. Aha, that was a nice one, buddy. And Polo's painting could be yours this Thursday. Art for the Animals is a fundraiser for Shamrock Pet Foundation. The event is 6 to 9 at Melwood Art and Entertainment Center. So go to Way3.com right now to purchase tickets and learn more about Polo the Painting Poodle, <laughs> Shannon. And I really love the hat Polo wears. Oh, yeah. Adorable. And I am impressed with Polo's work, but did you really see a swan? I, I actually saw a horse there. You really did. So it's, it's left to interpretation. <laughs> Impressionist, right? I want to get another look at that. All right. Thanks so much, Scott.